I just pulled it up and I got close to it and it locked it in. <laughs> That's kind of cool. <laughs> I'm kind of geeking out right here. <laughs> I didn't even have to attach it. I bought this real cool thing. It's a notch magneto. And all it is is um, meant to help tend your line. It's a, a connecting point for a chest ascender to your climbing system. And actually the Rope Runner Pro, it's actually meant for the Rope Runner Pro. Um, the way it works is um, this will be connected into this section right here on the Rope Runner Pro. And then what it does, it connects to your chesty here. And then when you want to disconnect, you just push and it disconnects. It's made with a magnet. So every time you go back to it, it locks it in place. So for it to work, you have to take this pin out and switch this post and it would stay on your rope runner pro. That's really cool. And I think that, you know, but once I do it, it's going to be stuck on the rope runner pro. What I also like to use is my rope wrench. And when I built my rope wrench, I built it with a slick pin from the wrench. So here's my slick pin. This is my connecting point. So what I thought I would do is to try to add it to where this slick pin is inside here and see how well it works um, when I use a rope wrench. Um, it looks like it might work, so I wanna give it a try. What I'll do is in a couple seconds, go out to the tree and I'll connect this all together. I'll try it out with that and just see how it, you know, if it disconnects and how it works with that. And then after I do that, then I'll come back over here and I'll put it to my Rope Runner Pro. I'm thinking that after I put it on this, it'll probably just stay there for good because it'll be a pain in the neck to um, put it in and out. Alrighty, let's get to it. I already have my ecstatic line set up in the tree for an SRS system. I have my rope wrench in the way I like to use it with my small tether and the clip that I created. So my idea is that it's gonna fit between here and the, the pulley. So I'll connect my pulley I'll connect it here. I'll move it up into place. Okay. And now what I'm going to do is get this set inside. And I'm going to put this magneto right inside there. And I'll slide it right into place, I hope. Let's see. Yeah, right there. All right. Locks it right in place. So now when I'm going to use it, it'll be here. So the next I need to do is put my carabiner on, connect it to my pulley right here and the other eye of the carabiner, I mean the cord. So there I go. Now, so the idea is once I connect this to my chesty, I should be able to pop it on and put it back in. So that's what we're gonna do. I'll give it a try, connect it to my post. All right. And then I'll connect it to my chesty right here. Now I'll try to I'll proceed into the tree and go on a branch and see how it works, see how it tends upward. Okay, throw it into my ascender. All right, all right, let's go. Pretty nice. No. There's no like disconnecting. It's pulling up really nice. All right, set back a little. Disconnect my sender. And then what I'll do is stand on a branch. Now that I'm standing on a branch, I'll disconnect it really easy. And walk back a little. Just a couple steps. Pretty nice. Now I'm going to uh, attach it back. Right there. Fits right in there. Now I'm going to walk in. Tend my line a little. Take a step up. Oh, nice. It doesn't disconnect or anything. Really nice. And if I disconnect, now ready to connect it back. Well, that's pretty clean. So what I'm gonna do now is I'll descend back down and then see what I can do by attaching it to my Rope Runner Pro. Let's see. Pretty nice. All right. 
disconnected. Oops, there it goes. Connect it back. Okay, so now let me see how hard it is to disconnect. Let me take it off of my chesty. Okay. And my saddle. Now the idea is I'm gonna just push that hopefully. So I'm guessing I should get that kind of close and push in that slick pin. Let me get to get that pulley kind of close. So there it goes. And then push it through. And there it goes. Disconnected. Pretty nice. All right. So we'll change this out and put it in the Rope Runner Pro. So here I have the Rope Runner Pro and here is a chesty mount. So that's where this is gonna fit in on here. So what I'll have to do is take this pin out. So what I'll do is I'm gonna depress this. I'll slide it through. We hope, <laughs> hang on. I'll depress that and this one here. And once I get it in here, I'll use this, this hole to find that pin, to depress that pin. And then I'll go to the next pin. Okay, here's the next pin. Depress that. So now this slides out. And now I'm gonna get this piece and I'll slide it back in, capturing the magneto. Let me see. There it goes. Lock it into place. Now it's mounted on here. I'll probably just um, leave the magneto on my Rope Runner Pro because it's kind of a pain in the neck to take off. Anyhow, let's go to the tree and see how it works. All right, here we're back at the Ecstatic and I'm gonna put the Rope Runner Pro on. I've already depressed both of the, um, uh, the pins on this slick pin. So you always wanna make sure that you twist to that hole. There's like a gap in there so the pin will fall in. And now you can place your rope in. So place my rope in, lock it into place. Now I'm gonna open up this slick pin. Once I open that, slide the rope inside this section here. All right, lock it into place. Open the pulley section up. And once I got that open, throw the rope inside, put it back in, lock it up. All right, now we're connected. This is where the magneto is. I'll connect this to my saddle. Lock it in place. Tend my line. Oh, <laughs> it popped in with, without me having to do it. <laughs> that was kind of cool. So uh, let me try that again. So. I just, uh, I just pulled it up and I got close to it and it locked it in. <laughs> That's kind of cool. <laughs> I'm kind of geeking out right here. <laughs> I didn't even have to attach it. So uh, now what I'll do is I'll throw my uh, foot ascender on and then I'll proceed up the tree and do the same thing, go up to a branch and see how it feels. Nice. All right, disconnect my ascender and put some weight on my Rope Runner Pro. I'll disconnect it just as I do my walk. All right, so now I want to connect it back. So just place it in and as I'm tending, it's really knocked, locked into place pretty nice. Hold it into place real nice. Yeah, and put my weight back on. It didn't move or anything. So I want to disconnect. Oh, really simple, just, that's so cool. All right, so yeah, looks like a cool little gadget. So I'll descend down.
Nice, nice, nice. So get down to the ground here and then get back to it. <laughs> That's pretty cool. It really connects on its own. And then it just dis disconnected. Pretty simple. Well, there you got it. The Notch Magneto. Well, there you have it, the Notch Magneto on the Rope Runner Pro. I mean, it's really a cool piece of a kit. <laughs> the way it just connects, well, I use my thumb there, but the way it connects. And also, um, when I tried it on my uh, rope wrench, I enjoyed using it there. But I think uh, what I'm probably gonna end up doing is leaving it mounted to this Rope Runner Pro. And, and it's actually a really cool kit, a uh, piece of kit that connects pretty easy and it stays on when you move around the tree and when you want to take it off super simple that's really pretty cool oh. <laughs> yeah there you go anyhow comment like and subscribe hit that notification bell if you like what we do and by all means share our videos take care